Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to take a look at your PlayStation Plus membership. So let's just go all the way there and we're going to see this PS Plus. So once we go into PS Plus, all the way on the left hand side, just scroll down once, just using your R1, just go on and go down. You're going to see this, go down a little bit more, and you're going to see exclusive packs down here below. Just tap on it. Again, go down. And then all the way to the right, view all, and you're going to see every single thing from here, which does include some stuff from Fortnite. Anyways, so anything that you don't have at the moment will not say purchase. Anything that you already downloaded from before will say purchase, such as these I have already. So we're just going to get started with these up here. And now you're going to see me download quite a few of them. However, you can download exactly the one that you just want. And yes, it's free. Just make sure your game is fully closed before you download these or else there will be a glitch and you're going to have to restart your PlayStation. Anyways, let's just get started. We're going to click on this one. We're going to add it on. It should say zero, by the way. You can confirm it. It's going to process. Thank you. And then you can just go back and continue on. Go back. And you can go on to the next one. Same deal. We can confirm our purchase. It should always say zero, by the way, because this is included. So we can go back and we're good to go. Keep going. And the only reason I'm getting all of these is because I use these. I'm going to use every single one of these. But again, you guys don't have to. Um, even if you don't play a specific game, I would still recommend getting some stuff that you may look into the future using because you're going to maybe use it. But anyways, uh, right now you're going to see that Apex has two options. This is the second option. It says unavailable. Don't worry about it. It's the same thing. It's just something glitchy that happens sometimes. So we actually did purchase this one from before. We also have this one. We don't have this one, so we're going to add it on. We're going to add it to our library. And it's been purchased. Next up, we have this. Add it to our library. And all done. We also have this comeback pack. Add it to our library as well. And good to go. Again, guys, I cannot stress this enough. Always have your games fully closed for this to work. Because you're going to notice that if you don't, then once you log into the game, you're not going to see these things. So whether it's a pack that you're downloading or something else, nothing's going to show up on your screen once you log into the game. If it's open already and you just minimized and you went here, you have to fully close it. Or at least, at least, if you don't know how to do that, which I'll show you in the end of this video, go ahead and just restart your PlayStation. That way you won't have any problems. Anyways, we're going to go on, add this as well. It's being added. And as long as it says purchase or after you download it, it says unavailable or something like that, you should be okay. So all these say purchased. I'm just missing these ones down here below. So we're going to keep going and confirm our purchase. You will notice that some make me confirm the purchase. Other don't. It doesn't matter. It's the same thing. It's going to work regardless of what you see. Um, this one, again, it's one of those glitchy ones. Not fully glitchy. They just have a PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4 pack. But it's the exact same thing. That's why they kind of glitch over one or the other. And um, they do expire at a certain point. So that just means that you cannot download it later on. So if you're looking at this video like a year from now, it most likely won't be there anymore. So you kind of just missed out on that. Anyways, we're going to add in this tool. Our library, we're good to go. Thank you. And we can just go back once again. Or just press continue. Whichever. Now these right here we already purchased. We're going to move on to here. And get some of this stuff, which is awesome for this game. Some of these bonuses that we get are really, really good. Others are not the greatest thing in the world. So let's just keep moving on. And we have this one. We're going to add it on as well. Confirm purchase. Thank you. And we can just go back. Now here's a special one for Fall Guys. Big fan. We're going to go on and confirm that purchase. Thank you. If at any point you guys see a price, which you shouldn't, just cancel it. But that's never going to happen. <laughs> it just wouldn't make sense. The only ones I'm not going to do right now are the Fortnite ones, and that's because that's a separate video. Now down here below, you're going to see this, and we can just go on and get it. 
I do want to mention that there are some packs that came out recently, actually, pretty recent, that uh, require you to subscribe to a higher level. So not essentials, but you would need something else in order to get them. So before I mentioned that there's some stuff that's um, paid for, so you see a price, don't do those because that just not, it's not really included, it's just a discount. I'm not really sure why they included those in here, they shouldn't have. All this stuff should be free in this section especially. But anyways, let's just keep going. Skip over the ones that they're giving you a discount. They don't make sense. That has um, not happened before at least. And we're just gonna move on and keep going with every single thing that makes sense so he says thank you we're just gonna go back go back once again and then we just have to let this load in and just keep going so here we go we have a few more add-ons we're gonna add it to our library purchased once again and then we're gonna keep going with this one we're gonna confirm that it's gonna process it should say thank you Go back again. Once again, we're gonna go back. And we are almost done because we only have two more to go after this one. And that's it for this video. But so far, we've gotten everything that we wanted, at least up to this point. Just before they expire, we can't get them later on. So it's really important to actually get them, even if you don't open up the game until later. It's good to add it to your library right now because it might be too late and you won't be able to add it in later on. All right, so at this point, again, you are confirmed that you purchased these because they should say purchased. But at this point of the video, we are all done. I'm just going to show you what I said about closing your apps or your games. So click on whatever game you have open currently. Then just go into your selections. You're going to see this, close game. Then you're actually fully closing the game. So right now, it's finally closed. So GTA, for me, it's fully closed. That's what fully closed means. Then when I can run the game, I won't have any errors. But as far as this video goes, we're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.